Hey gang, Tony here with this month's Crypto Curium Parcel of Terror Unboxing. Let the heavens rain hell upon us. I don't know. I don't know. But it sounded cool, didn't it? Okay, I'm gonna open this box because here's the thing about Crypto Curium's Parcel of Terror. You just know that it is filled with awesome. What is on the side there? Oh, I thought it was a drawing. It wasn't. It was a circled number. I love, I, I just love the stamps that you put on here, man. So cool. We have a, uh, an orange or red, I can't see in here, color, color! It's dark. But it's orange or red. Uh, shabada boom. This guy right here. This flying jack-o'-lantern of death. I love that. I love that thing. Alright, so, as usual, there is a very cool letter explaining everything. And the way I've been doing it, the way I like to do it now, I think, is to um, read what they are as I take the stuff out. That way I'm not boring you guys with one big long reading. So, I see the first item. I'm going to take it out. And this is awesome. Too cool. I didn't know... I really didn't remember this. Look at that guy. Alright, let's see what we have. It is... Doo -doo 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 -doo. Mystery item. This is the mystery item. That's why it doesn't look familiar to me. I was going to say, how did I miss this? <laughs> totally missed it. Alright, so that's the mystery item. The uh, Pazuza Cup. Possess yourself with the evil spirit of Pazuza as you imbibe your favorite beverage. From the legendary 1973 horror film, The Exorcist. Am I... Am I pronouncing that correctly? I hope I am. Because I often make a fool of myself with this kind of thing. This is really cool. I didn't even know you had the ability to do this kind of thing, Jason. Keeping secrets from us. I get it. Tricky. Very tricky. Alright, next item. We have a... Uh, you saw probably in the... It's the green uh, tissue paper this time. First up, ah, right on. It is the jigsaw pen. Come to Papa. Look at this guy. Oh man, this looks so gross. It's the jigsaw pen. All right, what do you have to say about yourself for this one? Jigsaw piece of flesh pen. The jigsaw killer would ca uh, carve jigsaw shaped pieces of flesh from the bodies of the victims and that failed his test. This was meant to represent the piece of the human puzzle each victim was missing. Cast in solid resin. Very cool. This is really, really just so gross looking. Which, of course, I mean in the best possible way. Awesome. Alright, next up, we have... Uh, aha! It's our slasher magnet of the month. This month, we have Chucky. I did not get one of the... Uh... Variants, I believe. If I, if, unless I'm, unless I'm remembering incorrectly, I think Jason made like five uh, variant bloody uh, versions that he randomly inserted in the boxes. So there may be some lucky people out there with bloody variants. I don't need the bloody variant. I'll tell you the truth. This is just too cool. Oh, the work that you put in with the stripes. I can't even imagine, man. Crazy. Such a cool magnet. Uh, Chucky magnet. Hi, I'm Chucky One Play. I'm not going to read that one just because it's a Chucky magnet. Child's play. You guys know. Sorry about that. It's my phone. All right, Chucky. I'm going to put you right there for now, but he's going to have to go up the top layer. Those are all Jason McKittrick's magnets at the top there. Of course. Very top. All right, next we have a Dracula sticker. High quality pearl finished die cut sticker. Classic universal monster. Alright. Gotta love those stickers. Gotta do something with these. I have a whole collection of them, obviously, from the boxes. And the wall plaque. Uh oh. The wall plaque. Everybody's favorite item in the box. I don't know. Maybe it's not. Maybe everyone likes the uh, slasher magnets or the stickers. I don't know. This is cool. This is going to be a two parter. So it's broken in half, not, you know, he purposely cast it that way. And um, 
Let's see. At the Mountains of Madness wall plaque fragment one. Something new for our fifth Lovecraftian wall plaque from uh, Lovecraft's epic tale at the Mountains of Madness. An elder thing can be seen battling something. Uh, complete with the artifact to see the horrific scene. Fragment 2 will be included in the, the July parcel of terror. Cast in solid resin with an imitation stone finish. Very, very cool. So we got the part 1. You have to get the next box for part 2. So it's an elder thing battling something. This will eventually be up here with my other wall plaques from Jason McKittrick. So you could look forward to that in future videos. I believe... Oh, no, there's one more thing in there. Got one more thing. This is... Let's see. Let me get it out first. All right. This is... Oh, wow. This is well put together, man. Whew. All right, so let me show you what we got here. Uh, Winifred Sanderson Spellbook Page. So this is a page as if torn from a spellbook. You can see that there. There you go. Take a look at the other side. A recreation of a page torn from the grimoire of the eccentric Salem witch. Uh, Winifred Sanderson. Printed on high quality parchment paper. Really neat. So we have a life potion on one side. And on the other side excruciating punishments in alphabetical order because is there any other way to organize excruciating punishments? I think not. H aching bones, boils, bunions. Oh man, <laughs> very cool. Alright, that brings to a close another epic parcel of terror. Hit the link below if you want to subscribe, which I highly suggest you do. Jason, again, awesome work as always. Everybody else, breathe deep in the night. One more video coming. Cheers.